And when he when he put those tariffs on China, made China back up? No, not not that's my man. That is he he knows the world system better than any of those guys. We need this country saved. Amen. It it needs to be saved right now, as everyone knows. Everyone can see, even though some won't admit it, it's going down and fast. So he has four years of proof that he can turn it around, and I believe he will. So my support for him is unwavering. Y'all yeah, see it, man. Which one are you in, though? Yes, I have seen a lot of black people waking up. It is like they have been sleeping for a very long time. At first, when you want to say or talk about Trump, some will tell you they don't want to listen. But now they have realized, they say, you cannot know the importance of someone when he's still there, when he's gone. That is when you realize his importance. Now they are seeing his importance despite the political persecution. I never watched The Apprentice. Yeah. I despised Donald Trump yeah. because he, to me, signified the rich white guy in Manhattan that absolutely hated and despised me, yeah. that hated and despised my cousins, my friends, everyone we knew, that, that, that called us wilding yeah. just because we were in the park. And still people who looked like them put him in rap songs. It was an indignity to me that something I loved, a culture I love, would lionize that. And so to me, this is justice. The fact that Manhattan didn't give him a mugshot, I thought was offensive. I thought that the Fed said, we already know what he looks like. He was the president of the United States. Okay, offensive. Everyone else had to take him. This case, and I think Fonnie Willis is a hero. She is a national hero because she, more than any prosecutor in this country, and I respect Jack Smith and I respect all the prosecutors that are doing this, she's the only one who said these wealthy, powerful, privileged men and women are just American citizens. And when they break the law, they will take that pay. Yes, oh, this lady is totally insane. Democrats are excited when you take a look at her, she is happy. Now bringing in this issue of race, if she knows what is going on in the street, she would not even open her mouth to say this. Photo taken tonight at the Fulton County Jail. Good evening, everyone. I'm Greg Cole. And I'm Shannon Royster. It is the first mugshot of a former president ever taken. You can see it now over my shoulder. Former President Trump and 18 co-defendants are criminally charged for their alleged efforts to overturn the 2020 election. A number of them surrendering. Today, Trump, his former White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows and Harrison Floyd, a leader of the organization Black Voices for Trump, were all booked into the Fulton County Jail. This, this, in, this indictment is a travesty. It's an attack on not just me, not just President Trump, not just uh, people in this indictment, some of whom I don't even know. This is an attack on the American people. If they can do this to me, they can do this to you. It has been a wild two days outside of the Fulton County Jail. And yesterday, Donald Trump's lawyer, Rudy Giuliani, turned himself in. We turn now to WJCL 22 News' is Olivia Wilde. Uh, she's been there since yesterday. It has been packed out there as well as passionate at times. Greg, that's absolutely right. I want to mention for the first time in two days, the police presence here outside the Fulton County Jail has finally diminished. I'll step to the side so you can take a look. There is just a single sheriff's car outside the jail here. You are seeing people able to pull up right to the jail, unlike they have the last two days. You can see these barricades still do remain, but the ones that stretched all the way down the street have been taken down. Let's get into some video that we took today. All day, there were people on both 
both sides here. Those who support the former president and those protesting him. We saw many people dressed up waiting for Trump to turn himself in. And at one point, a Trump supporter ran in the road with a giant Trump flag. Now, just after six o'clock tonight, U.S. Georgia Republican Congresswoman Marjorie Taylor Greene showed up to the Fulton County Jail to show her support for the former president. Here is what she had to say to a flock of reporters. The reason why I'm here is because this is my home state. I was born and raised in the state of Georgia, and I'm, I'm here as a Georgia, and I'm also here as a member of Congress. We're going to be standing up against the weaponized government. Now, before MTG's arrival, we spoke with some of the demonstrators here today. Donald Trump represent you, me, and everybody. What they do here is use the justice is a weapon, it's a political weapon. This is their only reason. And if we let this happen today, America's gone. Donald Trump is... You cannot know the importance of someone when he's still there, when he's gone. That is when you realize his importance. Now they are seeing his importance despite the political persecution. Trump is training everywhere. Blacks for Trump flood Fulton County ahead of Trump arrest for new release a puppet for the white Libras, according to this article. On Thursday, a massive crowd of supporters, especially Blacks for Trump, came out to show their support for leading put down 24 presidential candidate and 45th President Donald Trump ahead of his favorious arrest in 14 County, Georgia. I believe you've seen the mugshot. It is everywhere. And he came back on Twitter for the very first time. If you check that picture right now, you will see about 128 million people have seen it with 1.2 million shares and likes. That is to clearly test you how important this can be. One man, Derek Gibson, who has gone viral for wearing a N for Trump 2024 shirt, told a reporter, you want to know why I'm here to support Trump because they have done black men like this for decades. Make up charges so I know Trump is innocent. Like I said, they are seeing the truth, and I'm glad they are calling this out. I support Trump against this corrupt, two-tie justice system. That is why I'm here to show my support as a black man for Trump, and I'm wearing my shirt and for Trump 2024. And I mean that, Gibson added, Gibson said the Trump fought indictment is a bunch of bullshit. Fanny Willie is a puppet for the white Libra. She is in front, but the white Libra is back. There is pulling, they are pulling the string, Gibson said. In another video, a large crowd of blacks for Trump supporters can be seen shouting Trump, 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 Trump outside of Atlantic Fulton County G. A lot of people actually just believe that uh, this is just political persecution, electoral interference like I've seen. Black people standing up, it might be a landslide if people don't realize. Our campaign were not based on vengeance and grievance against one 